वेलकम बैक विद पार्ट वन सोल्यूशन ऑफ स्क्यूअर अटैक द पोजिशन इन फ्रंट ऑफ यू इज फ्रॉम द गेम बिटवीन कस्पारो एंड जुडित पोलगार इट इज कस्पारो टू प्ले एंड विन दिस इज फ्रॉम अ ब्लिट्स टूर्नामेंट सो कस्पारो ब्रॉट अबाउट अ सिंपल स्क्यूअर अटैक विथ क्वीन एच सेवन चेक आफ्टर किंग मूव आउट ऑफ चेक किंग टू एफ सिक्स वाइट गोस क्वीन अप number 2 in this position is from the game between mon popil and pilsbury with black to play here the skewer it is attack is brought about by a rook rook e3 check forcing the king away so the move king to d4 is answered by rook captures a3 and we see black going a piece up in the game next one is from the game lebrodonis versus wilson it is white to play and win we see two black pieces on the same line king and queen so winning move is easy to guess it is queen to f8 check after king moves out of check to e5 white is in a position to capture the queen of black number 4 in this position now is a bit difficult than the earlier three in the first three you had direct skewer attack but now here you have to bring a skewer attack what do we see in this position from the game between duras and cone played at carlsbad black is threatening queen g2 check and mate in support of his rook here and he has an extra rook so how can white save himself well if he can force the king on h5 then you know skewer attack can be brought on the queen on h3 it is with this idea that white first played queen to g7 and now let us examine the options before black the king cannot go to h6 h4 g4 and f4 so all these squares are not possible he has a choice of moving to h5 and f5 let us examine h5 first if he plays h5 now we see that king and queen are in the same line white moves his queen to h7 gives a check and after king gets out of check he wins the queen not only wins the queen he goes ahead in the material count now it is a comfortable win for him because he has got a queen and three pawns against a rook and pawn of black let us examine what if king had moved to f5 in this position then again it is the same thing we find both the king and queen on the same diagonal so the skewer attack can be brought about with queen d7 and again it's the same result after king moves out of check queen into h3 leads to capture of the queen now this position before you it's a pawn race from the game between alekin and capablanca with white to play both are on the verge of winning but white queens first plays f8 equals to queen black follows suit he also plays h1 equals queen he cannot have any other move in this position as now white has a queen on the board he can just move his queen to s6 and capture the pawn on the next move so black is forced to go ahead with queen but now what do we find we find the black king and queen on the same line so the skewer combination is not difficult to guess black plays queen to a8 check forcing the king off the check with king b6 and leading to the capture of the queen i hope you have understood this example let us now conclude part 1 with a position from the game between adams and britain played at london so here again we see it's like very similar we see both the black king 
and the queen on the same line white brings about a skewer attack with queen h8 check forcing the king of the h file king to g6 and leading to the capture of the queen on the next move i hope that you have been able to solve all this six position it was really very easy all you need is to just judge the how the how the pattern the pattern on the board find how you can bring out three pieces on the same line one of attacker and two of defender forcing the move of the first piece in line of the defender and leading to the capture we stop here now and i will be back with part 2 of this series on skewer till then goodbye for now